Well, hello there, and welcome to Surviving Nature with Mick Calborn, and I'm Mick Calborn. Today's episode is a good one. Today, we're going to see how long we can survive out in nature with only choosing three items. And I want a competition this time, and since we couldn't really find anyone, my cameraman Benny is going to help us out. Say hi, Benny. What's up? And uh, Benny is at a disadvantage because he has like no experience and I have like all experience, but we'll see what happens. Maybe he'll get lucky. All right, let's choose three items. Follow me. Okay, and here are the items we can choose from. We have a backpack, a roll of toilet paper, a can of corn, an apple, a bag, a pair of gloves, and a knife. And since Benny's at a disadvantage, I'll let him choose his three items first. Let's see what Benny chooses. Okay, so I chose the, uh, the backpack, the apple, knife. Okay, Benny just chose his three items, and his inexperience is kind of showing, but that's okay. So he chose the backpack, the knife, and the apple. Now I'll choose mine. Okay, I just chose my three items. The number one pick for me every time, cannot survive nature in the wilderness without it. Roll of toilet paper. Do not leave home without it. Cannot survive nature in the wilderness without one of these. My second pick, can of corn. Now, not gonna use it, but just in case of emergency, because also I can get my own food pretty easily. And third but not least, pair of gloves for building the ultimate shelter and getting my hands dirty. All right, let's start this competition. Okay, so it's been about two hours, and uh, guess what? I already have to use my first item, toilet paper. See what I tell you? I can only imagine how Benny's struggling right now. I don't know what he's going to do. Oh, if you find yourself without toilet paper, you can just use leaves. Oh, just make sure you don't use poison ivy, or else it's going to be a whole new definition of uh, timing food. You don't want that. You know when like when you eat some hot, you know later. Yeah, that's kind of what happens. I learned the hard way. Oh yeah, feel excuse. And you know what? I know what you're thinking. Mick Calborn toilet paper. You can only use it for one thing. False. You can use it for multiple purposes, uh, such as blowing your nose. Um, it's allergy season. So there's two things right there. Um, oh. And if you can't find things to start a fire, guess what? It starts on fire. Yeah. See? You gotta think outside the box. Alright, now if you excuse me. Well, I haven't caught any fish. I wish I had a spear. 
probably should have chose a knife so I could make some spears. The can of corn! <laughs> See, only me, I almost forgot. That'll be just fine. Ow! Damn it! All right, the only downside, it's a can. I have no way of opening it. Um, if I had a knife, I could open it. You know what? Gonna have to bash it against some rocks, I guess. Come on. It's just not working. There's a opening tab. I sure you would have saw that. Ah. All right, well thanks to that spear, I now have a backpack full of fish. I'm set. Oh yeah, I almost forgot about my apple. Okay, I just realized something. I don't have a knife to make a spear, but there's other ways to get fish. I'm gonna use my gloves and catch them the old fashioned way. All you do, stand in the middle of the river and you just scoop them up and throw them on the bank. It's pretty easy if you know how to do it. I'll show you. Okay, time to get some dinner. Whoa, whoa, that was a close one. I almost fell. And the last thing I want to do is fall in this water. You know, a lot of bad could happen. I don't have a fire to keep me warm. I can get hypothermia. You know, bacteria lives in this water. You know, it's gone. Oh, 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 damn it. Ow. Ah. So cold. That wasn't good. That shouldn't have happened. Oh. Oh. Damn it. Oh. What else could go wrong? Ow. Okay, so that really wasn't good. I really shouldn't have fallen in that water. No, I hate to do it, but I might tap out. But at the same time, I'm not afraid to because I had to have beaten Benny by now. I'm sure he's tapped out. I know this is the last person standing and I have a good feeling he already tapped out, so it's gonna call it. I won. Oh, sorry, actually Benny wins. He's still out there. Wait, what? Damn it. Ow! Oh. 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 What else could go wrong? Ow! Damn it! Hey, good news, Benny. You won the competition. Mick tapped out. Wait, what? Really? I beat Mick Cowboy? <laughs> well, all right. Wait, does that mean I won something? Was there a prize? I'm not sure. Hey, Kevin, was there a prize? Uh, no. Oh. Well, I guess not, Benny. Oh, you still won. He's bragging right. Well, I guess Benny won the competition. I don't know how. 
probably paid everyone off to let him win. Whatever. We'll have a good episode next time. Please join us for another great adventure with Mick Cavill. Seriously, how'd Benny win? Who helped him, huh? Was it you, Kevin? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs>